Everybody knows what it, how good it feels with the breeze in your hair when you're a kid riding your bike. It's almost like a perfect, uninterrupted conversation with nature. You know, there's no alternative, really. I'm not going to stop riding. Who owns the forests? The governments that take care of them or the people that love them? Building a trail is breaking the law. They were all renegades. We're taxpaying citizens. We demand this. Mountain bike community is all fired up. Of course, everyone's upset that the popular trail ribbed was torn out last week. Mountain biking is not a crime. Creating trails is. In order to get anything done, you're taking on this huge corporation or something, even though it's our own government. The slogan of the Forest Service is caring for the land and serving people. They keep saying, well, there's a way to get through and do, you gotta go through the process. As a federal agency, we have to abide by federal regulation. It's such a slow, laborious process that it burns them out. Nobody seems to know how to work through it. You're never going to get it 100% right. It isn't easy to be a ranger by any means. There's a lot of potential here. We can permanently protect the landscape and allow bicycling. And if we work together on that stuff, we certainly have a better chance. There's a lot of land management agencies at this point who have come up with really great solutions. We actually got our own meetings with our congressmen and senators. Never seen before. Dirt bike trails. Bike trails. Free ride mountain bike. There's a bike park like no other. Built by riders for riders. Woo! And it's not just for this decade or the next decade, but it's for perpetuity. When we get together and talk, we realize we're on the same side. <laughs>